welcome to Sam's Club and Costco. And today I wanna to compare Sam's Club and Costco and determine which is better, which one should you shop at more, which is cheaper and which has more snacks. And let's kick it off with the membership prices. Now, Sam's Club today, the cheapest option is $45, but if you sign up right now, they're gonna give you $45 back, a $45 credit when you come into the store to do your first purchase, which makes the basic membership free. If you wanted to do the plus membership, it is sitting at $100 a year and Sam's cash for plus members. That's like cash back, free shipping on all online purchases, curbside pickup, which the regular membership also gives you, pharmacy savings, optical savings, and everything else the $45 membership gives you. The Sam's Plus cash back gives you 2% cash back on your purchases up to $500 a year, which actually isn't that much, um, a limit of 500. So if you do a ton of shopping, uh, you're not gonna get that much back um, at the end of the year on your rebate check. The Costco membership is slightly more expensive than Sam's Club. Regular membership is $60 versus the 45 that Sam's Club has. And I don't know that I've ever seen Costco do a promo like we'll give you back, you know, a gift card to use in store or anything like that. And the executive membership or the gold membership or the top membership, this one right here is $120 versus $100. Now you get the same 2% cash back, but they cap it at $1,000 instead of Sam's Club's 500. So there is an opportunity to earn more cash back, but holy mackerel, that's a lot of spending to earn that back. Okay, Costco gets a bonus point for carrying Harry's, but the problem is they have 13 cartridges in here for $25.99 think you can get a better deal with my link below. Thank you to Harry's for sponsoring today's video. Even though you can purchase this set at Costco, if you go through me, Harry's is gonna give you an entire year supply for not that much more money than they're charging you at Costco. Of course, there are other bundles as well. You can do the Big Shave set for $36, the Big Shave and Body set for $41, or the Mammoth set for $68. That's my favorite and the best deal in the bunch. But by all means, you do what's best for you. This is a deal, check it out. The entire year set with my link down below in the doobly-doo, the mammoth set, they're gonna offer you guys for $68 for an entire year of personal care items. That is a savings. Here's what's included. You get the classic handle in ocean, 16 German engineered blades, two bottles of the foaming shave gel, and six body washes in all of the classic scents. I love the body washes. In fact, when I ran out, I went and bought my own. Uh, so Dave could smell like super manly and outdoorsy, you know, like a lumberjack. I love that smell. Except not stinky, just like rustic and good. Like a lumberjack would smell in a commercial, but not in real life, like that. With a flex hinge handle and precision trimmer, the Hero Razor is perfect for all the hard to reach places. And I'm a huge fan of the body wash. It's made with gentle ingredients that clean deeply while still leaving the natural oils intact in your skin. It's sudsy, creamy, and bubbly, and I love it. You can go to the website harrys.com slash FFM bundle. First link in the blue below, which gives you the entire full year supply for only $68, 30% off of that deal. It's sweet, link below. Now, if you're coming to these stores strictly to shop for clothing, Costco is where it's at. This Costco clothing section is like three times bigger than Sam's Club. The quality is better, the fit is better, and I personally prefer the clothing section here at Costco better than Sam's. Here's the question, which store carries more products? Costco only carries about 4,000 products, SKUs or barcodes or different items in stores and online, 4,000. That sounds like a huge amount until you compare it to Sam's Club. 6,000 to 7,000 SKUs or barcodes or products. Clearly, if you're looking for variety, Sam's Club is the obvious winner. It's not quite double, but it is close to double. Now you can't talk about the comparisons without talking about the food. And I'm only hearing the snacks because the produce department was very loud even though there's still this beeping going on. I don't know what that's about. Hey, if you are into that organic life and you really wanna find those organic products to feed your family, Costco pushes it a lot. They have a 
ton, a huge selection of organic products. In fact, it's harder to find non-organic products than it is to find organic products. If that is really important to you, this might be the place to come. In contrast, Sam's does not, and therefore, overall, their prices are less expensive. And while Sam's Club does have some organic, they definitely don't push the issue in the same way. So overall, the food, as a whole is less expensive at Sam's Club than it is at Costco, mostly because of the organic distinction. So if that matters to you, I would recommend going to Costco. Let's talk locations. I mean, if you're gonna go to one of these stores, you need to be able to find one. Sam's Club has 600 stores in 44 states, which is more stores, but in fewer states than Costco. Now there are 574 Costco locations in the entire United States covering 47 states. However, California by far has more than any other state. California has over 120 of those locations, which is amazing if you live in California, not so great if you live in Wyoming where there are zero. If you're lucky enough to have both, do a little jump for joy and a jig because um, some states don't have either store at all and a lot of people can't compare. They have one and that's the only one they can go to. I just found my magnet board that I bought a few weeks ago. They still have it. What's the price? It's a mystery. $23 for this magnet board. This is a deal. It's up in my office right now. They've restocked. I will also tell you I purchased this outdoor blanket. Not this exact one. It was a different one. I think mine was like $15. These are the best things ever. I use them at the beach. The sand doesn't stick to them. They're, they pack up really little. They're meant to get dirty. If you don't have one of those and you like being outside, I would highly recommend. I have gotten a ton of use out of mine, and if you're traveling, they fit really nice in a suitcase. We are here at the food court where you can get the amazing hot dog and a drink, like bratwurst-sized hot dog and a drink for $1.50. Sam's Club has a similar deal with pizza. It's $2.50 for two slices of pizza and a drink. Even though it says like pizza and a drink at Sam's, it's actually two slices of pizza. So if you break it down per serving, Sam's Club wins at $1.25 per serving. So the real question is, would you rather have this humongous hot dog or a slice of pizza? If shopping hours matter to you, you might prefer Sam's Club because they open a few hours earlier in the morning to accommodate their business or plus memberships. Um, it's actually one of my favorite things. They open at eight in the morning. Costco is 10 or 10.30. Now this store opens at 10 a.m. Uh, which sounds like a perfect time to open, except when my kids are off at school at 8 a.m., I'm ready to get things done. I'm very productive in the morning, and even though I do have to drive a little bit to get to the store, I show up at 8.30, 9, the store doesn't open until 10. Costco doesn't seem to offer extended shopping hours, which is a bummer. Usually at 10 a.m., the line to get in is just, it's so backed up, and Costco typically is more crowded than Sam's Club, so oftentimes, Sam's Club is a more preferable experience. Your mileage may vary, but this store is dead about an hour before closing. They close at 8.30, so if you show up at 7.30 p.m., no one is here. It's the best. Here's the thing. Comparing Costco to Sam's Club is very much apples and oranges. They don't market to the same people. Sam's Club markets to small businesses and restaurants, and Costco markets to people, <laughs> mostly women who like to buy pretty bowls like this. When you come here, you see the clothing section is bigger. You'll see the kitchen supply section is bigger. Organization is bigger. Books are bigger. Where Sam's Club will have more utilitarian items that businesses would purchase. A lot of the time, restaurants would purchase to use in their place of business. The people they market to have a lot of pull in the type of products they get, the prices that they have. So something to keep in mind. Okay, I could not do a Costco Sam's comparison without talking about the number one reason why Sam's Club wins, and it is the Scan and Go app and check out my friends. I downloaded the Scan and Go app years and years ago. It was like a Black Friday thing. The lines were radonk. We bought a TV for like nothing, essentially. They just gave us a TV for free. <laughs> you know how those Black Friday deals are. But I used my Scan and Go app 
did it, paid for it right on the app, and walked out the door and bypassed the entire line. It is single-handedly one of the best things I have ever used in my life. First time I ever checked out at Costco, I couldn't figure out how to do it. Like, they want the cart on this side, and then they want you on this side, but you gotta put your cart over here, but they want some things on the belt, but not everything in the belt. There's people everywhere, and there's 20 people behind you, and you're waiting for 30 minutes. It was a very stressful situation for me, and I felt like the new kid at school who was like doing the lunchroom situation completely incorrectly. I did not stick to the status quo. The second you put something in your cart, you scan it with the app, and by the time you're ready to check out, bada boom, bada bang. No line, no dealing with like, does the cart go on this side, do you go on this side? My car, I always screw that up at Costco. I always feel like the kid who's like not really sure what's going on, and I wanna be one of the cool kids, but I'm not. That's how I feel at Costco checkout. Here at Sam's Club, I am telling you that Scan and Go app makes me feel confident, a confident shopper, a confident checker outer, and you just blippity bon bloop right out the door. All you do is show your QR code on your phone to the checkout guys, they scan it, and you are good to go at Costco. You have to put everything on the scale and you cannot use the little gun to move heavy things in your cart. They have to get someone to come and help you do that. At Sam's Club, you don't have to take anything out of your cart. You just take that little gun yourself with no help and go boom, 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 done. In my experience, the checkout at Costco is really underwhelming. So I just gotta say, Costco, what up with that? Question of the day, does Costco's chocolate coconut almonds make up for the fact that they don't have the Scan and Go app to check out? really tough call. As I was leaving, I saw a guy walking out with an 86 inch TV, 86. Man, that's the dream right there, isn't it? I was like, dude, that guy's gonna have a great night. Could you imagine? It's like you're in the movie. Freaking amazing. Sam's Club in my area is by far the cheapest gas in the area. Today, unleaded is 4.19 a gallon. That is 50 cents cheaper than basically any other gas station. Did come over to the gas station here at Costco. Today, it's 4.13. So I, I was like, oh my gosh, Costco beat Sam's Club in gas prices, and I just double checked. Sam's Club dropped theirs to 4.13. Also, Sam's Club and Costco in my town are the exact price. So you have to ask yourself, which do you prefer? Sam's Club gas or Costco gas. I find the line at Costco is longer, but the other part is my Sam's Club and my Costco are on the opposite sides of town, so perhaps it's just where you happen to be that day. This is super interesting, and you can tell me what you think about this. Costco does not advertise their price on a sign out by the street at all. Sam's Club does. Sam's Club, you can see from blocks away what the gas price is. Here at Costco, you have to actually like drive up to the pump before you can see what it is. Very interesting, but who's better? Sam's Club or Costco. This is what I have determined in my research. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. What matters is what are you shopping for? What are your goals? What are you looking for? For every person, they're gonna have a different opinion. You might prefer one over the other. I actually don't. I, am, I like coming to both for different things. I'm very happy that I have both in my area so I can experience the best of both worlds. Did you come up with the same conclusion? Which do you like better? Thanks so much for hanging out with me today. It's always a blast when I get to hang out with my internet friends. Christine out.